Could Hallmark make the Christmas charade sequel? Rachel Scarston dishes on idea. Welcome to my channel, Hallmark's Gossip 24, where you can get news about. For more information, kindly subscribe and follow, and I am your buddy. Now let's get started. Christmas movie fans love the spy adventure movie, The Christmas Charade. This countdown to Christmas movie stars Rachel Scarston and Corey Sevier. In a recent interview, the Royal Nanny star hinted at a possible sequel to this romantic mystery. What did she have to reveal? Could Hallmark make the Christmas Charade sequel? Hallmark's The Christmas Charade is already a hit. According to IMDb, fans have already given it a 7.9 rating, which is exceptional. This is the story of Whitney, an elementary school librarian. She lives a very cautious life, if you don't count the rambunctious children at school. The daughter of home security experts, she has been taught to be safe about everything. One day, she decides to live up her life and take a risk. She decides to go on a blind date. However, after a mix-up, she becomes an integral part of an FBI operation that is trying to prevent another piece of precious art from being stolen. Special Agent Josh is not thrilled about bringing her into the fold, but Whitney continues to surprise everyone with her skill set and confidence. This comes in handy when the couple have to tango at the Christmas Eve charity ball. But that is just the beginning of a surprising evening. Some of the revelations hit close to home. Moreover, it seems that there is an opportunity for more of Whitney and Josh and their FBI escapades. Could Hallmark make more of these undercover stories? Speaking to Swoon, Rachel Scarston revealed that she hopes it happens. She shared that she and the actress who played her mom, Cynthia Dale, have already come up with an idea for a sequel. Because we had so much fun together. She even floated the idea to Corey Sevier, her co-star and the director of this fantastic story. His wife Kate Pragnall wrote the script. What did Rachel reveal? When I say floated, I mean, we were really pressuring Corey to get his wife to write a sequel. I would love to do a sequel. What was their idea? Rachel entertained the idea of a flash forward after they married and had children, and then a whole caper. Who does Rachel Scarson want to work with? Although Rachel Scarson joked that she is exclusive to working with Corey Sevier as they both starred in Jazz Ramsey, there is another Hallmark star she wants to work with. That would be Will Kemp, who also starred with her in the series Rain. They are really good friends and want to work together. Will can be seen alongside Brittany Bristow in the upcoming Miracles of Christmas movie, My Sweet Austrian Holiday premiering on Hallmark Mystery. Hallmark fans, do you want to see Hallmark make a sequel to The Christmas Charade? The scent of cinnamon and potting filled the room as Rachel Scarson sat down for a fireside chat with fans during Hallmark's Christmas Con, an annual gathering celebrating the network's festive films. Dressed in a cozy red sweater and perfectly styled for the holiday season, the Christmas charade actress shared insights about the beloved film and dropped tantalizing hints about a potential sequel. It's something I've thought about, Rachel began, her blue eyes twinkling with excitement. Fans keep asking me about what's next for Gwen and Blake. Honestly, I'd love to explore it. The first film left so many doors open for where their story could go. A recap of the Christmas charade. For those who may not remember, the Christmas charade premiered during Hallmark's Countdown to Christmas lineup two years ago. The movie followed Gwen, Rachel Scarston, a high-powered event planner who was forced to team up with Blake, Wes Brown, a former childhood friend turned rival to pull off a holiday festival in their quaint hometown of Pine Valley. The story was a quintessential Hallmark recipe, a little misunderstanding, a sprinkle of romantic tension, and a heartwarming resolution set against a snowy, idyllic backdrop. The film ended with Gwen and Blake sharing a kiss under the mistletoe after realizing their differences made them stronger together. Could there be more to the story? During the interview, Rachel mentioned that the idea of revisiting Gwen and Blake's story excites her. There's something magical about these characters. They've just begun their journey together. The sequel could explore what happens when their new romance is tested by real-life challenges. She elaborated on how fans have pitched ideas for a sequel. One fan suggested that Gwen and Blake open a holiday-themed event planning company together, and another wanted to see them face a long-distance relationship.
I think it's incredible how invested people are in their story. Hallmark has, has a mixed track sequels. record when it comes to sequels. While some, like the Wedding Veil trilogy, have found great success, others have struggled to capture the magic of the original. However, the network has shown a growing interest in building franchises around its most beloved stories. The fans' passion definitely gets Hallmark's attention, Rachel said. If enough people want it, anything's possible. What could the sequel look like? Here are a few potential storylines Rachel and fans have dreamed up. A Christmas engagement. Gwen and Blake are now officially a couple, but their relationship is put to the test when they return to Pine Valley to plan their own engagement party. Old rivalries and new misunderstandings threaten to derail their happily ever after. The Holiday Heist When a beloved Christmas heirloom from Pine Valley's festival goes missing, Gwen and Blake team up to solve the mystery. Their sleuthing takes them on a journey that rekindles the magic of their first adventure together. Christmas in Crisis Gwen's thriving event planning business faces an unexpected challenge when her big city clients demand non-traditional holiday themes. Blake steps in to help her rediscover the true spirit of Christmas while juggling his own family responsibilities. Rachel's dream cast for a sequel. When asked who she'd love to work with again, Rachel didn't hesitate. Wes, of course. He's the heart of Blake's character, and our chemistry really brought the story to life. I'd also love to see more of Gwen's family. Maybe we could bring in someone like Candace Cameron Buer to play her older sister. That would be fun. Rachel also expressed interest in involving new characters. Adding a little bit of drama or comedy with a quirky holiday enthusiast could be a lot of fun. Maybe someone like Tyler Hines or Andrew Walker could pop in as a friendly rival. The power of fans. One of the most heartwarming parts of the conversation was hearing Rachel talk about the fans' role in bringing the story to life. The fans are the reason we do this. Their letters, their social media posts, their excitement, it's all so inspiring. She encouraged viewers to voice their love for the Christmas charade. If you want a sequel, let Hallmark know. Share your ideas and your passion. They're always listening. A holiday legacy. The Christmas charade holds a special place in Hallmark's lineup, not just for its heartwarming story, but for the way it captures the essence of Christmas. Rachel's enthusiasm for revisiting Gwen and Blake's story is a testament to the magic that the network has brought to audiences year after year. Whether or not a sequel gets greenlit, one thing is certain. The love for the Christmas charade will continue to shine bright in the hearts of fans and the festive memories it inspires. Would you like me to expand on any specific storyline or angle, such as a behind-the-scenes look or a deeper dive into fan theory?